Okay, so in this video and in a few uh, coming videos, we're going to be looking at something called SURDS. S-U-R-D. So SURD is the singular, SURDS obviously is the plural. Uh, we need to know what a SURD is before we can start doing any maths with it. Uh, it's probably easier if I show you a few SURDS. Uh, that's a SURD. The square root of 7 is a SURD. Uh, let's see what else I can do. Square root of 11, that's a SURD. Uh, the square root of 15 is a SURD. The square root of 22 is a SURD. Okay, so these are SURDs. Uh, let's take a look at some things that are not SURDs. Uh, really simple one. Uh, the number 8. 8 is not a SURD. Uh, let's take a look. 2.5 is not a SURD. Um, 3 sevenths is not a SURD. Uh, and finally, really interesting one that I think you'll find. Uh, the square root of 9 is not a SURD. Okay. Uh, so you should be getting a fair idea of what a third is. Uh, it's the square root of a number. That much is true. Um, so this is a third, this is a third, this is a third, this is a third. Why is this not a third? It looks like a third. It looks like all of the other ones. Now the reason root 9 is not a third is because it can be simplified. If you put square root of 9 into your calculator, some of you already know what the answer would be, here's my calculator. If I press square root 9 on my calculator, I actually get an answer of 3. That's why root 9 is not a third, because it can be simplified to the number 3. Okay, uh, finally, let's give us a definition, uh, a formal definition for this. A third is a root, okay, you call this a root, whether it's a square root, you'll learn about cube roots and fourth roots and fifth roots later on. A third is a root that cannot be simplified to an integer. Okay, so I've used a couple of uh, words here that you might need to look at. A third is a root that cannot be simplified to an integer. Some of you already know what integers are, but in case you're not sure, an integer is just a whole number. Okay, so if you can't put it into your calculator and come up with a whole number, uh, then all of these square roots are what we call thirds. In the next few videos, we'll take a look at doing some maths with some thirds.